I'm Terry Jacobs, also known as the Tropical Makeup Expert. And by the way, I am a breast cancer survivor. And I am a person that has always been very fastidious about my health. I go for my well woman visit every year. I go for my mammogram every year. And one day I was helping my mother move and all of a sudden I felt this throbbing on the outside of my breast. And there it was. It was about this big. It was the size of a peach pit. And it really took my breath away because I thought, you've got to be kidding me. I came to see Dr. Horse. She was very nice. And she said, don't worry. We'll contact you in two or three days and let you know what the results were. The next morning at 9 o'clock, the phone rang. And it, when I saw it was the Diagnostic Center for Women, I thought, OK, this can't be good. Yeah. And she told me then that the, the tumor was malignant and now I had to come back and do, I believe it was an MRI was the next thing. And till they, till they could determine exactly what kind of cancer it was. And as it turns out, it was triple negative. I'm Dr. Akari Horst, a top line MD radiologist at the Diagnostic Center for Women. When a patient's diagnosed with breast cancer, um, some of the tests, additional testing that they do on the material that we provided the pathologist, um, they do test for the estrogen receptors, the progesterone receptors, and the HER2 new receptors. And this is um, something that is either expressed or not expressed um, in the tumor cells. And uh, in Terry's particular case, she actually was triple negative, which is a, a more um, complicated uh, disease process because um, the changes the way that they have to treat her with the chemotherapy drugs. Once all the diagnoses were in, I realized one thing right off the bat. Just like it matters what makeup artist you use because there are makeup artists and there are makeup appliers. I consider myself to be an artist. So just like that, there are radiologists and there are radiologists. It matters who's reading your tests. And I am grateful for the care and the attention and the thoughtfulness of everybody at the Diagnostic Center for Women. I met Christina. And Christina is just awesome. She followed me through all of my tests. She made sure that when I did my, I'm very claustrophobic. So I did not think I was gonna be able to do the MRI. And she said, I will be here with you. I will stand here with you. And she did. She had her hand on my back and she talked to me until I said to her, I was okay. Hi, my name is Christina Opegi. I'm the nurse navigator for the Diagnostic Center for Women. This very emotional to know that they come here as a patient. They don't know who I am. I don't know who they are. And all of a sudden, I became this support system for them, even for issues that had nothing to do with the breast. So it's a very uh, close bond. If I could say that there are angels on earth, there are. Don't look to the left and don't look to the right. Go directly to the Diagnostic Center for Women, because there you're going to get what you need with compassion.